Hey, what's up, guys? So apparently today is Avengers Infinity War Day. I mean, we just got so much stuff that released today. We got a bunch of brand new teases for all new Hot Toys 1-6 scale figures. Avengers Infinity War stuff. Not only that, the Funko Pop uh, Pops were released today, and apparently the Marvel Legend figures were, uh, were released today as well. But going to Hot Toys, so they teased us for, you know, a couple images of Captain America, which you are looking at right now, which I can't wait because I want to see a bearded Captain America hot toy. He's one of the main reasons I'm excited for Avengers Infinity War. He's one of my favorite characters. And they also tease a new Thanos. So I'm glad I never picked up the Thanos from Guardians of the Galaxy, even though it does look awesome because he comes with the throne and everything. But I'm glad I kind of, you know, I missed out on that or passed on that because now we can get one with the Infinity Gauntlet. And they also teased an Infinity Gauntlet. Now, I don't know a whole lot of information on this life-size Infinity Gauntlet, but it's so freaking nice. It's life-size, guys. This thing is huge. I think it's almost about two feet tall. But, um, yeah, this is something definitely I'm going to be picking up and adding to my collection. I, I think it lights up. I'm not sure if it has sound effects, but, you know, if you guys can't get this, there's always that Marvel Legend one. Anyways, so today we're doing the video on some pre-orders that came up that you guys might be interested in. Again, click in the link in the description below, guys. BigBadToyStore.com if you want to pre-order the two figures that I'm about to talk about. So, Thor. They released the brand new pre-order images of Thor Infinity War. That rhymes. So this is pretty cool. Now, it gave a... Look at that seamless uh, arms right there. That looks really cool where you can't see the joints. Look at... They also teased a brand new Rocket and the Teenage Groot. So that's pretty cool. I'm pretty... <sighs> I wonder how many characters they're going to make from this movie. Are they going to are they going to make like every single superhero from this movie? I don't know. But you know, I'm not the biggest fan of Thor from the MCU. Um but I mean I love the first movie, but this Thor looks awesome. I really really like this one. And I actually like the Hot Toy Thor Ragnarok too, but this one looks really cool. Here's another tease of uh, Groot and Rocket Raccoon. Though they look really good. They look, Groot looks awesome. Those aren't for pre-order yet. It's just uh, the Thor. But look at this. So you, kind of a spoiler, I guess. Maybe. I don't know. You can see his uh, Stormbreaker, the new weapon that he's going to be using, which is made out of Groot wood. And then he's got some light-up effects. And you, the lightning effects also you can attach to him. You got the cape right here, which looks really cool. And, the, and you get the eye patch. I think the eye patch is removable. So you can see... Some really cool images. Now, I think the price on this is $266. Hot Toys is kind of raising their prices, and I, I really don't understand why. But, I mean, the figure looks great, but it's, this is almost reaching the $300, you know, price point. I, I, don't, I don't know how I feel about that. But, I mean, overall, this Hot Toys figure looks great. What do you guys think? Are you guys going to pick this up? Are you going to add it to your Thor collection? What is your favorite Thor? If you, if you guys own any Thors, which one is your favorite out of all the Hot Toys one that we've gotten so far. All right, moving on to the next figure that's up for pre-order. We have Iron Man Mark L. Now, this is from Infinity War also. Like, if we don't have enough Iron Man figures, right? We only got about, what, 60, 70? Anyways, I'm just kidding. Anyways, this guy looks great. He look, the, the suit looks really smooth, really sleek, but we're going to get to the price point here in a second. Now, he does, gonna, he does have a little bit of die cast uh, parts to him. And he's got 30 ports of articulation. He's got some LED, I think 21 LED light-up features. And you can see he's got some, some uh, attachments you can add on, some cannons. And, uh, and uh, has anybody ever really gotten a Hot Toys in this pose? Let me know in the comments below. The figure looks great, though. I really like how this, this looks. I like how those panels rise up in the back. And then here is with the Robert Downey Jr. head sculpt, the Tony Stark head sculpt, which looks great. They've always pretty much, for the no, for the most part, nailed, you know, the likeness on Robert Downey Jr.'s head sculpt. Looks really, really good. So the price for this figure is over $400. It's $406 on Big Bad Toy Store. That is kind of high. I do not know why this guy is priced so high. Maybe it's because of, obviously, it's die cast and it has... A lot of light-up features, I'm not too sure, but it does look cool. Again, if you guys want to pre-order these, click on the link in the description below. Again, guys, if you guys pre-order from, from the link below, it's going to help out for my channel. And I can also it'll help me out so I can do giveaways for the channel. So, you know, if there's anything you guys want to pre-order, click on the link in the description below. If you guys do, let it be known that you guys clicked on my links to pre-order something. But anyways, you guys let me know what you guys think about these Hot Toys and what Hot Toys do you want to see them make in the as far as character go in Avengers Infinity War. Give the video a thumbs up. We'll see you guys soon.